All right, bros. So here is the brand new Shimano SLX DC 150. And of course, I've got it on my custom Shoreline Adventure Bro rod. We're just going to be giving a few casts to see how the DC settings work and to give you a review of what I think. If you hear that noise, it's a high pitched, low audible whine. That's the DC braking system. So when I take this and I cast it, I'm gonna show you guys that I'm not gonna thumb it. Minimal backlash. On any other reel, that thing would have been crazy. Crazy backlash. Let's see it one more time. Here we go. I'm gonna dial those settings down just a little bit. There it is. See if I can get you a good view of casting over the shoulder. And this is going to be on the number two setting with my tensioner set to just allow slow, steady free fall of the desired lure or setup that I have at the end of the line. So it won't be an official review until I can get a fish on it. Man, you got something back there? This guy back here is actually catching stuff. And he's got a good fish on. <laughs> and I'm I'm gonna let you fight it too. Cause that drag, he's beating your ass right now. I'm gonna let you fight it. We about to see. Lift your leg up real quick. Lift your this his leg up. It's gonna be a good fish, man. Ooh, look at that black drum. Hold on, slow it down, slow it down. Ooh. <laughs> it's a good black drum, man. I'm gonna leave that drag like it is so you can feel. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Slow it down, slow it down. Bring it to the net. Bring it towards the net. There we go, there we go. There we go. Look at that. Hey! <laughs> I just put my best friend on his best fish. Let's go, bro. It was fighting, man. <laughs> you didn't know what to do, huh? I don't know what it was. I'm on this. <laughs> How you feel? So tired already. Bro. Tired! <laughs> I was catching what? Uh, croaker last time? Yeah, last time you were catching croaker, man. That's a ticket pole. What the hell on, man? <laughs> <Relax>. <laughs> there we go. You're gonna eat that one. Dude, no freaking way. No freaking way. There's a little hole over there in that in that rock. I just cast into that hole. <laughs> no freaking way. So look over there. There's a hole in that rock. 
I was trying to just land on it, but I landed in that hole. Hopefully you guys are able to see that. That's a pretty good cast. So I will say that this rod and reel, or this this reel, Shimano SLX DC 150 is pretty damn good. Especially with that digital control braking system. It allows you to make more casts with less backlash. I couldn't have done that again if I tried. I need more line on here. I'm probably gonna get spooled. Easily gonna get spooled, easily. All right, so this thing is handling this spoon like a freaking champ, throwing it amazingly and I didn't even change the settings much definitely need more line on this reel if I don't thumb it all that's gonna come off all of it is gonna come off you see that it's not enough line I need probably 20% more line I think we got one, bros. Matter of fact, we do not. That was just me reeling that spoon up quick. No, it was, it was something. It was probably small though, probably sand trout. Dude, I can cast this thing off. Like, I, I need more line. I probably need 20% more line. 